There it is. It's becoming visible. We've done it. We've done it. I'm Peter Brady. For some time, I've been working on the problem of invisibility. your eye. Come along with me. I'll show you. She's dead. He's amazing. He's incredible. I'm here to help, and I'll be beside you in this. This is the experience of a lifetime. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you particularly. Welcome back. When we last met, we just met two new contestants. They just got settled in, and we left you. Let's see how they're feeling today. All feeling okay? No nerves at all? All calm? But first of all, we have to meet the next contestant. Thank you. Let's get on with the next one. <laughs> what B was a racket? A... Yes, bombing and acts of terror. Well, well done. That's a good start. <laughs> I didn't know, in fact, I've only found out since last we met, that you both play musical instruments. I and my predecessors, both Democrats and Republicans. What about loudmouth at the end of it? I've been in public life for more than a quarter of a century. There's almost no time at all. Sad. You must take it up again. But that would be a cowardly thing to do. Do you want me to start asking you questions, or would you rather we got on with the next game? Nobody has anything to gain by delay. Gee, suspense is killing me. Here's another. What you was an American president called Grant? Uh, yes. The... What were you going to say? Um, the... You may be just too young to remember, and it's sad, but there it is. Here's another, which you'll know, all of you. <laughs> what F is a cheat? Free enterprise. Good interruption, wrong answer. What F is a cheat? Yes. The frozen Iranian asset. Yes, good one. There we are. Well... One game all, and we're into another decider. And they're uh, battling away here. They're very evenly pitched, aren't you? I think you're terribly brave. I have seen four wars in my lifetime. I don't ever want to see another generation of young Americans bleed their lives into sandy jungles in the battlefields of Asia or the muddy Pacific or muddy rice paddies of Congress. I don't ever want to see another rice beachhead in Asia or the muddy bloody fields of rice jungles of Europe. Anyway, let's get on with the job in hand, shall we? We have other things to talk about, but not just yet. It's the deciding game. They're one all, and it means that whoever does this goes in for the gold run. Here we go. What are is a usually rambling performance. Yes. A president in the Oval Office. Yes, right. yes. Good one. What C is a monster with a lion's head, a goat's body, and a dragon's tail? Oh, dear me. Congress. What? Congress. <sighs> Crisis. Have another go. Campaign. No. Communist parties. No. Here we go with this one. What M is where Humphrey Bogart ran Rick's Cafe in the film Casablanca? Managua. No. Honduras. No. Costa Rica. No. El Salvador. No. Guatemala. No. Here's another, which you'll know. <laughs> what N is what you are off if you are balmy or potty? Yes. With regard to uh, the uh, with regard to the the uh... no, it's not quite right. It doesn't work in with the sentence actually. Nut is the answer. You're off your nut. Okay, fine. 
The moment in your career when everything changes direction. That tragedy is over. Old Testament tit for tat. Inside Washington politics. Part of a tree you hold out for peace. It isn't nutmeg. Well, the big question now is, is it going to be our chickpea expert that is going to get down there on the hotspot? Right, now it's your chance. Will you accept our invitation to take the hotspot? Thank you and God bless you all. Nancy. Westminster and Whitehall, the focus of power. Power to influence the lives of everyone. Power sought by men like Caswell Bly and John Wilder, a man who shakes boards of directors, manipulates politicians, and conspires in high places. Watch out for John Wilder in The Power Game. <laughs> 